Hello student of grade 9, we'll be doing exercise 8.1, question number 9 and 10 in the same video. Question number 9, they have given ABCD is a parallelogram, P and Q are the point on the diagonal, AB such that BP and PD are same as per the given. You are going to prove triangle APD this triangle equal to this triangle congruent so let us prove these two are same first so you can check the question also what they are asking to prove I have already written the given and to prove okay now first let us prove the first question in triangle APD and triangle QCQB. We'll try to prove these two triangles are congruent. A, B, D, and C, Q, B. So what are the equal things we can see here is these two are same. It's already given. B, Q, and D, P are same. So we can write D, P equal to B, Q. It's given. Second point, this angle will be same, 1 equal to 2, this is alternate angle, angle 1 equal to angle 2, reason is, alternate angles, second point is done, third point, these two sides are same, why these two are same, opposite sides of parallelogram, we can write, AD equal to BC, reason is, opposite side of parallelogram, Clear. Opposite sides of parallelogram are always equal. So we got three points. That means the triangle is congruent. A, P, D is congruent to triangle C, Q, B. What property we're using? S, A, S rule. So first proof is done. Now if these two triangles are congruent, we can say that these two sides also will be same. A, P equal to C, Q because this is a part of this triangle. So we can write AP equal to CQ, reason is CPCT, corresponding part of congruent triangle, mark it one. So second proof is also done. So if I prove these two triangles are congruent, then this also become equal. So now let us prove the third in triangle AQB and triangle CPD, what is same? In this two triangle, we can say that these two are same. DP equal to BQ. It's already given. In these two triangle, DP and BQ are same. This angle will be same, see. Alternate angle. As yes, this is parallelogram, I can mark 2 equal to 3. This angle will be equal to this angle. Angle 2 equal to angle 3, alternate angle. Second point is done. Third point, this opposite side is same. We are taking this triangle, okay? I'm just shading it. These two triangle is same. Our uh, side is same. AB equal to DC. Reason is opposite side of parallelogram. So we got three points, that means triangle is congruent. AQB is congruent to triangle CPD. What's the triangle? Oh, tell me the rule, we're using two sides and angle, so SAS rule. Once the triangle is congruent, each part becomes same, that means these two sides, opposite side also will be same. Because AQ is a part of this and CP is a part of this, we can say. AQ equal to CP, reason is CPCT, corresponding part of congruent triangle 2. Now, if you see step 1 and step 2, we are, fine, we are getting that these two are same and these two are same. If pair of opposite sides are same, that means this is a parallelogram, okay? So, therefore, from 1 and 2, we can say APCQ is a parallelogram so we have proof all the five 
this is first one second one third one fourth and fifth fifth we are getting from one and two if the opposite sides are same pair of opposite sides are same then the figure must be if the opposite sides are same then the figure must be parallelogram clear pause the video to write the proof let's do question number 10 a b c d is a parallelogram and these are the perpendiculars on the diagonal so we are going to prove this triangle are congruent so let us prove first we can write in triangle a p b and triangle c q d in this triangle a p b and c q d find three equal thing one is these opposite sides are same so we can write a b equal to dc reason is opposite side of parallelogram second point these two angle will be same i'll mark one equal to two this is alternate angle we can write angle one equal to angle two alternate angles third point each 90 perpendicular means is fall at 90 degree we can write angle a p b equal to angle c q d reason is each 90 a p b equal to c q d so we got three point that means triangle is congruent a p b is congruent to triangle c q d by a a s rule we're using these two angle but on we're using the other side so a a s rule so if the triangle is congruent automatically these two will be same a p equal to c q so a p equal to c q reason is c p c t hence proof you can pause the video to write the proof thank you